It's Joshua Gar from Android Authority. What's going on, everybody? And I'm here at the beautiful LA Arboretum in the wonderful 626 to bring you another drop test. And this time we're talking about the Samsung Galaxy Note 3. This is the one that just came out and it has a bit of a different design philosophy. So we want to see how it holds up to our drop test. Instead of glossy plastic, it's a textured plastic. The sides are a lot flatter. And overall, its design is just a little more decisive, if you will. Now we're gonna jump right into it, but you guys know the drill. I'm about 5'6", so I'm gonna be dropping it from about five feet, right on its back, and then on a side, which is its bottom, and then finally, on its face. So, one thing you have to know though, drop test can be kind of random. I'm gonna do my best to get it to drop perfectly onto the floor, but even if it drops a little bit weird, we'll see how it, how it does when it hits the floor. Let's get dropping. Here is the first test on the Samsung Galaxy Note 3, falling flat on its back, well, hopefully. All right, all the cameras should be going and... Oh. And... Oh. The only real damage that you can see is right around here where it landed. There's a couple scratches there, but other than that, the Note 3 seems to have survived the back test. But let's see how it fares in our side test where we drop it right onto its bottom. So here we go. Here comes our side test, drop it right onto its bottom, and here we go. 